You are now tuned in to Sakara.com. Oh, we are here at the FIT DENYC press event. Um, I'm Candace Pelletier, the designer. Um, we create swimsuits and have just launched a new active wear um, component to what we're doing now. So we're most known for um, Miss America, Miss USA contestants and doing their state productions and have worked with a lot of great people. But we're excited to be here tonight and to meet everyone. So I actually, um, I'm a former Miss New York um, back in the day, and um, I moved to New York to be a Rockette. So I think it was actually, I was a performer and then kind of competing and doing things in here in the city. And uh, it was my last day um, in the season of Rockettes. I was in the ice bath and I was like, you know what, I gotta, I gotta think of something else. And my mom, actually, she was a seamstress and created all of my swimsuits for when I competed at Miss America and actually my audition leotards to be a Rockette. And so my mom was the initial talent and then sort of a business was born at that point. Wow, yeah. awesome. So then as far as um, some of the contestants, do you wanna name maybe two or three that you've worked with? Sure. So we have worked with the past, um, five out of the six consecutive Miss Americas in the past. So um, Kira Kazanstev, Mary Hagen, who's actually running for Congress right now in Alabama. Um, we, Nia Sanchez, Miss USA. Um, we have been able to work with Denise Richards um, and some other supermodels as well. So we've had um, a lot of great traction in the past six years that we've been in business. It's been a good run. That's awesome. If you want to get any advice to anyone that's looking to start their own uh, career with their fashion, what would you give no, I think the thing is, is is to really know your customer and to know what that customer wants. Um, your demographic is the most important. Who you're reaching, why you're reaching, and what kind of what kind of clothes or fashion or item, what do they want? Um, because once you know that, then you can really sell, which is the most challenging part of being in the fashion industry.